neighbor. I'm so glad you could come to my house with cat. I have made some special cookies for both of you. Thank you, Miss Lucy. It is a beautiful place and the weather is very pleasant. Cat told me that you are very good at mathematics and will give us word problems to help understand addition and subtraction better. Yes, sure. Let's start then. Okay, so let's see. Let's start with cookies. Amber, you solved the first word problem. The plate of cookies has 14 chocolate chip cookies and 12 butter cookies. How many cookies are there in all? The number of chocolate chip cookies is 14. The number of butter cookies is 12. So, the total number of cookies is 14 plus 12. First, we need to add the ones. So, 4 plus 2 is equal to 6. Then we add the numbers in the tens column. 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. 14 plus 12 is 26. So there are 26 cookies in the plate. That's wonderful. That is the correct answer. Yippee! Now, let's solve an additional word problem with carry. The plate of cookies has 26 chocolate chip cookies and 18 butter cookies. How many cookies are there in all? The number of chocolate chip cookies is 26. The number of butter cookies is 18. So the total number of cookies is 26 plus 18. First, we need to add the ones. So, 6 plus 8 is equal to 14. I will write 4 in the ones column and carry over 1 to the tens column. Then we add the numbers in the tens column along with the one that we carried over from 14. So, 1 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 4. 26 plus 18 equals 44. So there are 44 cookies in all. That's wonderful. That is the correct answer. Now, let us solve some subtraction problem. Cat, it's your turn now. There are 34 cookies in the plate and Amber ate 12 cookies. How many cookies are left in the plate? The number of cookies is 34 and the number of cookies Amber ate is 12. So the number of cookies left in the plate is 34 minus 12. First, I will subtract the number in the 1's column. 4 minus 2 is equal to 2. Next, we subtract the numbers in the tens column. 3 minus 1 is equal to 2. Yes, Amber ate 12 cookies. <laughs> I mean, I ate 12 cookies. <laughs> awesome! That is the correct answer. Here's the next subtraction problem. I went to the market with 36 rupees in my pocket. I bought a plant with 18 rupees. How many rupees were left behind in my pocket? Total number of rupees is 36. Number of rupees Miss Lucy spent is 18. So the number of rupees left behind is 36 minus 18. First, I will subtract the numbers in the 1's place. As 6 is smaller than 8, we will need to borrow from 3. 
16 minus 8 is equal to 8. Now I will move on to the tenth column. 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. The answer is 18. Excellent! You two have solved the word problems very well. I am very proud of you both. Thank you so much, Miss Lucy. So let's quickly go over what we learnt in this lesson. Addition and subtraction can be used to solve real life problems.